This is 13 June over here in the corn patch. Getting a lot of deer pressure. See these stalks laying over. But we are getting corn. Starting to form an ear. Some there. Kind of hit and miss. So I did get a lot of pressure from the deer. Next problem is not going to rain for the next 10 days. And uh, it is looking a little dry up here. But it's getting some air. Could be deer, could be coon. Ground's so dry, I can't see no track. But she's definitely getting some critter pressure. Uh, now, like I said in earlier videos, this is the first time growing anything on this dirt since probably the 1930s, and this was all woods. But something's going on, so it ain't terrible. We'll get enough to put in the freezer. That's all I care about. My pinto beans. Ugly, 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 ugly. I'll go ahead and get on the uh, Farmall 140. And cultivate the rows. But it's just ugly down here. I don't know why. But it is what it is. Why the hell I can't grow a damn bean up here on this dirt? Dirt's not that terrible. The corn's doing good. Of course, I fertilize the heck out of it. But I also fertilize these beans when I planted them too. I don't know. It's going to be a mystery for sure. Well, like I said, I'll cultivate what I got. And there's enough. I get a bushel or two. That's a lot of effort for not much gain. I don't know. I'd figure this one out, especially before I plant next year. Uh, this fall, I'm going to turn this with a mold bore. I got my chisel plow to break up the crust underneath. Get some air going in the soil, allow a pathway for water. And uh, we'll have to see what happens. Thank you.